Welcome everybody to the second mission and third episode of Steel Division Normandy 44. Now the last episode was kind of cut short because the mission just ended, which is okay, I guess. Um, so now we are on the Blood on the Rizzes. And uh, I will read this out real quick and then we'll jump right in. Excuse me. Major Warren, 4th Infantry Division, is moving inland, expanding the beachhead. But the success of Overlord is still in the balance. Our party troopers have been dropped in a somewhat cavalier manner and regimental objectives are being held by mere companies and battalions. We need to reinforce them. Your objective with the advanced elements of the 4th the 4th Infantry Division under your command is to get to St. Mary Iglese as fast as possible to secure the 505th Parachute Regiment. They are too few and almost out of munitions. Get to them, resupply them and help them to fight off the German counterattacks. You will get priority support from the Air Force and Navy guns to help clear your way for that mission. Fourth Infantry Division is still in the process of landing, but the Germans are starting to react and closing on the beachhead from all sides. The 505th in St. Mariglis reports being under siege. We have to reinforce them ASAP with any help the 4th Infantry Division can provide. St. Mariglis is surrounded on all sides, Major. Colonel Ekman, the 505th CO, reports heavy shelling and infantry attacks from the north, while tanks and armored vehicles, mostly French captured ones, are attacking from the south. Up west, a grenadier regiment has taken defensive position, preventing the 505th from reinforcing our other regiments at the Merderay's bridges. Colonel Ekman also reports some German paratroopers elements taking position east of the city, but not attacking. They must be there to prevent anyone from relieving our garrison. The 505th is running out of ammo. We must break through to them with supplies, then repel the German assaults until they back down. Yeah, we can do that. <laughs> Compose your battle group. Okay, let's have a quick look. We know here is enemy artillery, here is enemy uh, tanks. The enemy can also respawn units here in this area. Um, up here I think it was infantry, but that's not too important. And we know there are some units in here. Okay, let's compose our battle group. The main task of our recon units should be to detect I really wish I could switch them off. This is... This is terrible. Um, I'll take these because we get them 20 with it, which is nice. Um, I kind of want them 8. I kind of do, but we get them later. But uh, I think this is going to be okay. Let's stay like this for the moment. I definitely want some leaders. I want some machine guns. I want some engineers. I want some rifles. I want more rifles because rifles are awesome. Uh, I want a heavy machine gun and I can take these as like late game infantry because they have a strength of 12. They don't have anti-tank weapons which makes them weaker and they only have 1 MG so if you take this one it also has 1 MG but it has 2 Thompsons and it has the bazooka so those are worse than these but they're also cheaper so I might just use them to hold a line maybe. Let's see. Amphibious tanks which broke through from Utah Beach yesterday. Use them to open the way to St. Mary Glees, but be weary of enemy anti tank guns. I'm gonna take a shaman, uh, some shamans with me. Um, I'll do it like this. This way I can have four tanks. Um, it's okay. I could change it to five tanks by re replacing this, but then only one would be in the first. Um, uh, in the first phase, so I think this is the better choice. It is imperative that we bring a significant number of supply vehicles to okay. replenish the 505th stock. Supply jeeps have a limited capability, but they're immediately available. They can be used to resupply our troops. And I'm not sure why this or even captured Opal trucks later on. is under support and not under artillery. Because to me, this looks like an artillery. Uh, an artillery with a very short range, but still. I'll take it with me. And... Okay, so this is like a German. Let's look, see here. 
Um, some anti tank, some anti tank, some more anti tank, and maybe this anti tank. <laughs> Not entirely sure. Our artillery could dislodge enemy anti tank guns threatening the road to St. Mary Gleese. We've also received artillery observers, OP, who may call long range heavy artillery strike. These strikes are very efficient, but take some time to be effective. I don't know how they work, so I'll take one with me just to try it out. And. Like this. Please be quiet, man. You're very, very annoying. You are very, very. Just because I don't really know what's coming, I feel this is a good mix. We'll try it like this. So, how do we want to advance? Um, for infantry, maybe go up here and in here. I kind of want to go on the right because then I'm closer to the artillery and I might be able to immediately take out the artillery, but uh, it's a long shot. I don't know. Ah, <laughs> I did not bring enough freaking in first phase with me. I definitely screwed that one up. Uh, hop. Up. Do I advance along the whole front? Uh, wouldn't it be better if I spearhead through it? I think I'm not gonna push on the right side right now. The reason why I'm picking mid and left instead of mid and right is because here we're very much in the open. But I could try to completely folk because the enemy would also be in the open if I do take this. And then I could move up here. I, I, I think I wanna clear out this area. So let's take some rifles. I will need more. I will take the tank. Mm, you can argue that a tank in the beginning is too expensive. And probably you'd be right. <laughs> we'll still deal with it. And I kind of want to get this because I want to see how it works. We do have a lot of time to reach the city and this is not a f long way. So we will have some time to shell the enemy. So how about we take something like this? Now we still have 30. Um, we don't have any more, do we? No, we don't. Then I'll take the heavy machine gun. Not too sure about this. Um, I want all of you to empty into that. I want the tank to go here. I want you guys to get into here. And I want these units to empty out here. So let's see how this works. Didn't the guys say the south is not attacking because they are quite clearly attacking. Ready to pound them, sir. So we're moving up a bit. Wow, there's a lot of enemies here. We'll Yeah, this is this is dangerous. There's so many of them. Yes, sir. Roger. You no, need no, to pound the artillery and what are you? Is that an anti-tank gun? I'm actually not too sure. Please get back. Move up. Move up. Okay, you'll have to shoot at them. Why aren't you shooting? Nice. I'm gonna move up those troops. Um, I hope this will be okay. I think we're gonna be okay pretty soon. Got the beast, sir. 
I'm gonna get a second tank. I wanna increase the firepower here on the open. I know they have a lot of uh, anti-tank things, but because it's so open the area, I think we'll be fine. You need to shoot them down. Now the engineers... Oh wait, they're both engineers. I screwed up my deployment, damn it. Yeah, I don't have anything anti-tanky here. Which is kind of okay, because I don't think the enemy actually has tanks here, but still. Wow, damn it. They have a direct line of fire on my infantry, that's bad. I'm gonna get some infantry in here. Let's get some rifles in there and give them a bit of recon. We will have to push along that side this road. Okay, our left side has basically been taken out because now that they are pinned down, they are pinned down. Uh, maybe they will be able to kill him or pin him so they get free again, but I kind of doubt it. I'm gonna send some engineers from this side in order to yes, help. Um, those tanks should be fine in killing them. Actually, you can shoot at that. Please try. I feel like getting a Mustang, but it's so expensive. I think it's better if I just get more infantry at this point. Uh, let's get way more infantry up here and just try to spread out a bit. Okay. He's falling back. This might save at least one of the two mortars that we've lost due to our inability to perform simple tasks. You go up here. I'm gonna need a supply vehicle. Oh, damn it. I wasn't paying attention. I should have known he's there. I, I've seen him advance. I just don't know why I didn't do anything about it. It was 100% um, my idiocracy that killed this tank there. Um, also, those... They are going to die here. Um... I'm gonna send some more rifles and have them stand here just to hold Ready back the enemy a bit, but... Uh, we're not in a good position on our left flank. I don't know if or how much the enemy has on the right flank, so no judgment there, but I think it's gonna be okay. Basically, this will be our supply route, right? Another one bites the dust. So... Wow, look at that. Move up those units. Wow. I've really not done a good job on this side. <laughs> Let's try it like that. You move back. Please get in there. Get in there so we see the enemy. There we have it. Get out of there. Get out of there. Get out of there. All of you, please. I'm gonna storm the enemy on the open field here. Which is going to be okay because they're all surprised. And then I'm gonna use units to secure this side of the road. I already have some units on this side of the road to secure it. So... That will be kind of okay. You will have to exit. You will have to exit. I know there's enemies somewhere around here, so let's try it like that. These units, the enemy is pushing in from the left, uh, which you can move up. You need to destroy that thing. I'm still not 100% certain what that is, but I know I need to kill it. Ooh, we have a problem here. You need to kill him. You need to kill him. Move here. 
You guys go in there. You guys go up here. I think I just need to go in there and this will give me the command. But I still have 17 minutes and... Uh, I kind of want to be in a safer position, I think, when I'm taking this over. Yes, sir. Please move up, move up. We do need recon on this side, so let's get some pathfinders in there. Don't have any more tanks. Um, I don't think I need this. Could get some more RT. Air recon and support could be handy here. They would make short work of enemy AT guns or troop concentrations. I kind of want a Mustang more than a Grasshopper. Oh, damn it. How did this happen? How did that happen? You need to go in there. You need to smoke. No, that they're dead anyway. There's no need to smoke here. Yeah, they surrender. Oh, they surrendered. Yeah. Now we've lost those for good. Um, you will need to go in there. You will have to go in there. And then we've cut off these units and I'll take care of them in a bit. First I want to take care of this area and I'm actually getting a Mustang at this point. And I'm going to send it at this location. Come on, come on. Nice. Uh, unfortunately, it's still standing, but it, uh, we're going the right way. Um, we will get a supply truck at this point. This MG doesn't really have a reason to be here anymore, so I'm going to use it up into this place. And I need normal rifles, but I don't, I don't think I have any more. No. Only in the next phase. In a bit I can get these, which is okay. Oh, sorry. Uh, these. And we're just gonna use these rifles to get them. I'm sending these units down here. They should be able to take care of that. To maybe save that. It's gonna be a tough one. He can shoot through any of this, which is bad. You need to go for this. You need to go up here and take care of him. Please go here. It's um, as I said at the end of the last. Um, wait, what happened here? Okay, as I said at the end of the last episode, I'm not particularly good at this game, so <laughs> you see me struggling more than I arguably should be struggling. Can you use the flamethrower to destroy that? I don't know. Please do get in there. Um, artillery, please shoot at that. You guys all need to exit your vehicles. You go in here, you go up here, you also go up here. This is going kind of okay. He can start dashing out the Ducker. Nice. I'll have him go a little bit closer so his MGs can actually fire. Distance 800, so this can shoot now, I believe. Yes. We still haven't been able to make contact with the 505th Major. Air support or naval artillery could help to secure the road's flanks. Yes, um, I'm aware we haven't made any contact yet. But we are very slowly securing this area, so I'm positive about that. One of the many problems we're facing at this point is... I, I'm gonna get this unit just because I wanna try it. One of the many, many problems I'm facing is... Uh, I'm kind of out of good infantry <laughs> because I've been wasting it. Um, it's absolutely my fault. I've, I've not taken good care of my infantry. Um, 
How do you work? Call artillery. Nice. Roger. Move you up. Yes, Let's move you over here maybe and you in here. I hope this works. You move up here. You move here. You also move here. Move this here. You up here. Mm -hmm. Gonna move him up. I don't want to get him in any close combat action. You see how quickly they die to infantry when the infantry gets to them. It, so. 88. They've got a damn 88 millimeter. Be careful. Um, where? Okay, over there. That's absolutely okay. Go in there and then go through in the middle. There must be an enemy over here. Um, dead. Sir, yes, sir. I'm gonna get some guard rifles in there. I don't know what kind of enemy it is, but I think we can manage. Please kill them. I'm gonna move with these right up here and try to take this because he can spawn units from here, I believe. So I'm trying to make him stop that. With the first elements of the 500 bits, sir, their communications have broken down. They're asking for orders. Boys from the 500 bit have salvaged a German 88 millimeter gun, but they need ammo to feed it. You need your well, goddamn 88 millimeters. Um, we're supposed to be surrounded. Okay, there is the enemy. You shoot at that. Yes, sir. Enemy is chosen. Actually, how about you move up? I don't want to send my tank into the enemy 88. So you move up and I'm gonna do this. Okay, I first need to move up. Let's move him right here. You move in there. You move up. You move up. He's not gonna get in there. They're gonna pin him. This is really getting annoying with this unit moving through here. Oh, where do all these units come from? Damn it! <laughs> Let's get some more rifles in here. And maybe this leader, I don't know. And let's get another Mustang. Oh, here we have that. So why haven't I gotten these units under my command. Let's get another supply unit in here. Go like this. I think we're doing okay-ish. We're obviously having the problem that the enemy has gotten here. Um, can you please attack him? Please? Get out of there! Shoot him! Get out of there! Shoot him! And you too. Go get him. Uh, we know he's walking here, we just can't do anything about it. You go here. The enemy has huge amounts of units everywhere. Um, Um, oh, now it's firing. Okay, so until now it's taken. Five hundred bit reports serious casualties, but they're holding. I've gotten. Yeah, they are reporting huge casualties, and I'm not sure what to do about that. The problem I'm having over here is I'm not getting command of these units, so I'm not sure how I can get these twenty units under my command. You go here, you also go here. We have pushed the enemy back quite nicely. Build a decentish position over here. Your long range. Move up. You move up as well. Okay, I've gotten them under my command. This work. Go here.
You just stay here, um, hold, try to hold back this enemy. You need to do this, you need to do this, you need to shoot at them. So maybe get a tank here so he can fire up there. I think that's a decentish position. And I definitely want some artillery here that's shooting into this army. Wow, we've lost these units already. We really aren't good with our units. Like, if, if you get sent to war, try not to be under my command. <laughs> How about we go like this? Ah, uh, maybe you go like this. Naval battery. Okay, we've almost taken out the naval battery with this, so we'll just try again. I think they're gonna be kind of okay. Yes, sir. They're doing terrible over here. Um, you need to go here so you can fire up there. Yes. You'll bring your MG into you this position, I think. You wanna go here? Please storm him. Shoot him. Shoot him. And we really do need some support units up here. Nice. Also, I'm getting a free airstrike because I've taken out the 88. Okay. Nice. I mean, <laughs> not war changing, but it's okay. You please shoot that. We'll you you also shoot that. You move up there and try to your best. You could go here so you actually become useful. The enemy is getting in reinforcements from here. I think he can't do it once I'm taking this place and then he'll have to come from here. Which would be nice. Um, let's try that. Try to move up over here. Let's try to move up over here. Got pieces, sir. We we you flank him. Okay, we are taking out him, but we still have an enemy here, but that's okay. We him, you, flank him. you need to move up. You need to move here. He's also moving up. He's gonna come my direction, right? So let's put you in here. Oh, no, 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 no. Move back, move back. <laughs> when they're done, I'm gonna try to bomb the enemy with this, but... Yeah. Okay. This was my bad. So... Did I have a limited number of off-map strikes? Why can't I... Isn't it reloading? Please increase the artillery, Dhaka. We need to. We need to. <laughs> Did she say let's liberate some ladies? That's sexist. <laughs> okay. We screwed up the left side by me advancing. That was dumb. They're coming, um. and they brought those damn B1 with them. Got the pieces, sir. So the enemy is coming. We're gonna get another tank, so and the Germans are wavering. We just have to hold them at bay for a little longer, and they'll give up. Okay, so it says three minutes. So I think we're gonna be okay. I don't really know, I'm just hoping at this point. Like, everything I do is just praying. <laughs> uh, this is going very bad. Okay, we did at least get that one unit that kept walking through our back. Let's get some more MGs up here and just get units in there. Anything at this point. Okay. 
Okay, our right flank's also collapsing. Um, we are holding the city. I'm... I'm gonna leave those units like this in here. Um, I know it's stupid because half of them don't fight at this point, but I don't want them to be hittable by the enemy, so I'm trying to open it up a bit. Just get out and try to take some positions. Um, you can go up here, you can also go up here. Get the MG in there, you come up here. We've destroyed some enemy units again. Keep hitting, keep hitting. You in here, you also in here. Okay. They're gonna die, but I'm absolutely okay with that at this point. So it is only 20 more seconds. I don't know if afterwards it's okay or... Get down. I hate those damn screaming ninnies. The Germans are pulling back, sir. The siege is lifted. Okay. The 505th is taking heavy casualties, sir. So we did it in 25 minutes, half an hour-ish. Um, I think all went well. Again, there's no KTD here. Um... I think we've done fine. Um, obviously you could do better. <laughs> uh, that's okay, we did get the 100% um, because we took the 88, I think the 88 was the next thing. So burning bridges will be the next mission. I hope you've enjoyed this, I certainly did and I will see you for burning bridges. Have a good one, bye bye.